Hi, welcome to another episode of Hot Takes with me, the Silver Fox. Kate Forbes, does she know what she's doing? She's supposed to be charge of finances and, you know, responsible for, you know, money and dealing with income and expenditure and all this all stuff, right? Theoretically. But it would be helpful for a woman who is actually an accountant, a fully qualified accountant, to be able to understand that VAT cuts when you're having high income tax isn't really a good look. But that's where she is. She's realised people are a bit poor. They need to make people feel a bit richer in order to try and, you know, peel, help people decide to vote SNP, shall we say. If people were just a bit richer, they might vote for us because they think we're doing a good job. And so she's calling for a cut in VAT. Now, VAT is not an option for the Scottish government. It's not devolved. It runs from Westminster. Well, rather than calling for a VAT cut, which isn't going to happen, but which sounds good, if you're truly uh, concerned about people and their income, how about cutting income tax, which you can do quite easily, well within your gift? Well, of course, you only have to realise, of course, a moment's thought. They've got no intention of cutting taxes. They just want to be seen as being willing to cut taxes. And then when the VAT isn't cut, blaming Westminster. It's a bullshit argument and we can all see straight through it. Oh yes, if we say we want to cut VAT and the English go, and the, look at the, the English ain't doing it, the English ain't doing it. Look, it's them. No, Kate, you're the one that's putting income tax up. That wasn't Westminster, was it? If people are poor, it's because you're taxing them. And if you truly want to untax them, reduce income tax. I dare you. Thanks a lot. Bye. What have I done? Oh, yes.